Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. Today we are watching Wednesday, um, season one, episode six. And, <clears throat> oh, sorry, my voice. This one is called Quid Pro Quo. So, I'm super excited to uh, get back into this show. If you have not watched the last episode with me, go ahead and click right up here, my friends. Give that a watch and then come back and watch this one with me. I am really, really liking this show. Um, I've heard mixed reviews on it, but so far, and we're pretty much, we're over halfway with this one. Yeah, so far, over halfway through. I really like it. So I'm assuming if you're watching this, you like it as well. So thank you for being here. Uh, what else? If you would like to watch this reaction and all my other reactions with me in full, no edits, uncut. <laughs> Some people like that, I don't know. Go visit my Patreon down below, my friends. What else was I gonna say? I lost my train of thought, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, so. Patreon, if you feel like you want to watch uncut reactions and get them sooner than YouTube, go check out my Patreon. I'd love to have you friends. Okay, enough with that. Grab your coffee, grab your water, grab your tea, grab your snacks, and uh, let's get to Wednesday. I'm excited. Cheers. In case you're wondering, I don't hold seances very often. I can barely tolerate the Very living. often. I just really want to know if I'm right about the monster. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt your... Seance? You have a relative named Goody? She was one of the original outcasts. You thought about using one of my scented candles? The aroma of steak tartare is too dark. Ew! <laughs> Gross. Oh boy. Interesting. Yeah, I really, 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 really want to know who the monster is. I just want to know if I'm right or wrong. <laughs> Though I think I'm going to be right. I don't know. What died? Smells like childhood. <laughs> mm, that was great. Smells like childhood. Who do you think's gonna be there? I think it might be Bianca. I mean, giving her answers, not that she's the monster. I'm gonna be a savior. Is that his name? Surprise! Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Oh man, I thought it was gonna be like actual information. Happy birthday. That's the perfect cake for her, though. You. For real. I thought my cake design was pretty inspired. The pink balloon was my little touch. Wait, is Tyler there? Fire will rain when I rise. The first part of that phrase was brought mm. on in every song. That's true. It can't be a coincidence. Wait. <laughs> I was told you could teach me how to control my ability. There is no controlling a raging river. You must learn to navigate it without drawing it. Hmm. Well? Is that a scarf that like she it? made? What is it exactly? It's a snood, oh. silly. I don't know what that is. And you want to know what the best part is? I have one too. You still think I'm the monster? Haven't ruled it out. Yeah, well, when you change your mind and you want my help. I don't think it's him. I, I think I've already said that like a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's annoying, but I don't think it's him. Now, why wasn't I didn't see Tyler at the birthday party? Is that just because he he's not a student there, so he couldn't make it? 
I haven't always been against birthdays. Each one reminds me I'm a year closer to death's cold embrace. Oh, God. Well, that's a cool... Birthday party Pinata. games. It all feels so trivial. Oh, but she's talking to, to Eugene. And that I'd be sorry for it. <laughs> Dr. Kimbod, I haven't seen you since our session with your family, which was... You know, she's kind of weird, too. I don't remember if I said it in the last episode. She, uh, she's a suspect, too. Wait, what? That was weird. I don't know if I missed something with the flowers, but... I don't know. No, usually a quad there he girl, is. I've been working on that all week. I worked on that all week. Is there anyone thing didn't tell? Well, who do you think delivered the cake? Oh. Yeah, I went with a 98% dark chocolate ganache, knowing your preferred color palette. That was sweet. Okay, did, did I do something? I just feel like ever since the raven, you've kind of been ghosting me. Guess I got my answer. Poor Tyler. I need your help. Don't gloat. What, do you want some drawing lessons? Yeah. <laughs> I saw that in a vision. Do you recognize it? Oh, there you go. This is much better. I started having those dreams again, like before. Do you know where this is? It's the old Gates Mansion. I pass it when I go running. Oh, oh, well, Wednesday. Is she gonna love it or hate it? After the dance, I just wanted to forget about you, but I couldn't. So I started painting and that's what came out, all right? I feel like it's the only time I get to see the real you. Oh boy. She's got two boys who like her. Do me a favor, Wednesday forgot this. Could you give it back to her? Aren't you a boyfriend? No. He definitely wants not. to be. I'm definitely thinking... Oh, yeah. So, the last episode? The um, grave the, of the boy that um, Morticia killed? I feel like the monster has to be the sister that disappeared. Right? Because didn't, didn't they say that in the last episode? She disappeared or something? Anyway, yeah. She's there. Garrett Gates. Oh, <clears throat> speaking of. <laughs> the sheriff told me his family died, along with their legacy of hate. See, now she's going to his house. It has to be related. Goody showed me this house for Yeah, reason. it has to be related. To its secrets. That's funny how I was literally just talking about that, and then it comes up. So I think... I could be off, but I think the monster is related somehow to this family. Uh-oh, is someone in there? Oh, that guy's in there. Why is he in there? That's kind of weird. Sheriff, pick up your damn phone. It's noble. Listen, I might have figured out who's behind all of this. She literally just got in his... In his SUV. I thought she was going to explore the house. That took a turn. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. I was not expecting that. He's alive. Barely. Wow. What were you doing in the back of the mayor's SUV? Spying. <laughs> I saw him coming out of the Gates mansion. 
Back when the mayor was sheriff, he used to have a lot of wild theories on cases that he couldn't solve, so. Call me old fashioned, but when someone is run over on their way to give the police key information, it yeah, you think? they were onto something. Wednesday. I just heard what happened to Mayor Walker. I Are suspect. you all right? I... One of them. You could have been seriously hurt or worse. I saw this on my bookshelf and thought of you. Oh, Frankenstein. Mary Shelley wrote it on a dare when she was only 19. She's both my literary hero and nemesis. <laughs> Man, I need to read Frankenstein again. I read it in high school and I remember really liking it. And it's on my, it's on my TBR, to be read list, again. I don't need your help or your pity. I already have a mother and a therapist. That's enough torture, even for me. Oh, Wednesday. He might have just pissed off the monster. Just saying. Oh. Hello? I've reconsidered your offer. Really? That's great. Um, when are you free? Pick me up outside the Nevermore Gates at 8 o'clock. Oh my god. Wait, he's our Uber driver? Uber driver? I thought we were going on a date. I thought this was a oh, girl's night no. out. Oh no. What's up with the weird matching hoodie and scarf? <laughs> Don't ask. <laughs> Just drive. Oh my god. Poor Tyler. He's always like so out of the loop. Hey, Wednesday? Oh, Xavier. You guys in here? Nope, they're gone. What does she think? <laughs> this place is creepy AF. I know. Okay, this isn't what I signed on for. Ditto. She wants to explore. I want to do this. Then you should have just said so. You didn't have to trick us. Maybe Tyler and Enid should get together. <laughs> I don't know if Wednesday's ever going to let him in. Pointless. Can I try? Use your claws. Oh, there you go. Wolf strength. It's a werewolf thing. That's the car. Okay, this just took a dark turn. Yep. We need to call Tyler's dad right friggin' now. This is the night I'm gonna die. <laughs> so, do you guys like exploring, like going ghost hunting or exploring creepy places? Because when I was younger, I loved doing that all the time. I mean, I still, I still would like to do it. Um, I just don't have the the chance to uh, do it as much. <laughs> but yeah. I enjoyed it. It was fun. There's Garrett. His outcast hating father, Ansel. And you must be Laurel. They're all long gone. I thought Laurel disappeared. Did they say that she died in the last episode? And I'm like not remembering. But she looks, you know who she looks like? She looks a lot like the therapist. Seen enough? Not yet. Secret room. Blood will rain. Who doesn't have a spooky built-in altar in the <laughs> library? I was just <laughs> more seating for year-long theaters. Oh my god! Ours is in the living room. All right, Tyler, you check the rest of the ground floor. Ina and I will search upstairs. Uh, by himself? You go left. I go right. You seriously want to split up in here? That is literally how every best friend dies. <laughs> uh... Wednesday, you need to see this. The 
of beds made. No dust or cobwebs. <gasps> it's yellow flowers. It's the fucking therapist. LG. It's the sister. It's the therapist. She had the same flowers. It's not possible. She died 25 years ago, drowned overseas. That's why they zoomed into the flowers, I think. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Did Tyler die? That's the monster! <laughs> oh no, I heard Tyler get hurt. Okay, so maybe he's not the monster then, if he got hurt. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Hey, yeah, monsters not being nice to Wednesday anymore. Okay, you guys really need to go find Tyler. Um, there's, oh, there's the missing body parts. So does that mean that the therapist is the monster then? Cause she was on my, she was on my list too. What are you doing? These are the body parts missing from the monster's victims. <laughs> but it looks like a boy monster. You okay? Since when do you care? So I don't know. Can you can you really tell if a monster is, is a boy or a girl? <laughs> I don't really know. Oh, there he is. Still can you walk? What is he doing there? Here, take this. That's not a good look. Savior. Not a good look at all. Thanks, Doc. What the hell happened? This was you, wasn't it? Like that, please. I'm okay. Sheriff, I understand you're upset, but I think you need to see something. It's all gonna be gone, though. I think everything's gonna be gone. They didn't get any evidence. Yep. It's it all cleaned all out. Listen, yesterday I told you all signs pointed to this house, and I was right. Is that your justification for almost getting my son and your friends killed? Huh? Row. You directly violated oh, no. my explicit order and left campus during a lockdown. I'll never apologize for trying to uncover a truth. What is this? It's a warning from Rowan. Is this why he tried to kill you? His mother drew it before she died. Said I was destined to destroy the school. One more step out of line and you will be expelled. No ifs, no buts. Oh boy. She dodged a bullet on that one. Where are you going? Yoko's room. Oh man. Thornhill said I could crash there for a few nights. You will use anyone to get what you want, even if it means putting them in danger. I've tried really, really, really hard to be your friend. Uh-oh. You want to be alone Wednesday? Be alone. Ruh-roh. Goody warned that I was destined to be alone. But for the first time in my life, it doesn't feel good. Oh, what's that? Is it a picture of the therapist? Oh, it's pictures of Wednesday. That's creepy. We all seem to be connected like a spider's web. Oh, no. Oh. I and thought that was Eugene. Too close to the truth. Uh oh. He was silenced. Uh oh. 
I will find you. All right. All righty, my friends. And that was the end of that episode. A really good episode. Um, it was a I feel like it was a little bit slow in some parts, but that's fine. You're never going to have episodes that are always action or always, you know, stuff going on. So now I don't know if I was right about the monster. Well, actually, no, I take that back. I take that back because I still have my three guesses or I still have my three uh, suspects, which now I think have gone to, well, could still be Tyler because we didn't actually see him get sliced. Do you know what I mean? So he could have just transformed into the monster when they were upstairs and screamed and, per I mean, he could have screamed and then transformed into the monster and pretended that the monster got him, right? Because we technically didn't see him get attacked. And then they ran away, so that would have given him time to transform back into a human and go and lay down in that, and where they found him. I'm not ruling Tyler out yet, but if that's the case, why would he want to kill Wednesday? Cause it looked like, it looked like he was trying to, maybe, I don't even, okay, maybe I won't see a kill, but it did look like he was trying to hurt them. I don't know. Now my other two suspects are um, Mrs. Thornberry, is that her name? The teacher, Christina Rishi's character, and um, the therapist. Though I think the therapist is, well now I know, she's Laura Gale, the sister of the boy that got killed. So could she be the monster? She absolutely could. That would make sense because the monster showed up in her house where she's staying. But again, that could have been Tyler. It could have just been there to throw us off. You know what I mean? Again, I don't think it's Xavier. I think that would be too obvious, even though he did show up, but I don't think it's him. I, uh, ew, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's driving me crazy. <laughs> um, what else? I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm really enjoying the show. Wednesday's relationship with Tyler and Xavier is interesting. I mean, they both like her, obviously. Would they, would they both be good for her? Yeah, I think so. I tend to more, I tend to like lean more towards Tyler with Wednesday for whatever reason. I just feel like his character is more genuine, but again, I could be totally wrong. I don't know. Um, now Enid and Wednesday, that's, that's too bad. Enid just really wanted to be Wednesday's friend. She was really trying and you know, as much as I like Wednesday, she can be a biatch sometimes and you know push people away but that's her right like that's her personality and I don't know if they're going to like throughout the rest of the show kind of develop her character so that she grows I guess you could say it's growing she grows and morphs into somebody who actually um, seeks friendship and who wants friendship and who doesn't want to be alone anymore it's kind of seemed when they were going where it kind of seemed that's where they were going at the end of this episode. Anyway, yeah, I think those are all my thoughts for now. Loved it. Thank you so much for joining me, my friends. I hope you had fun watching Wednesday with me. If you are not subscribed yet, please subscribe below. It means a lot to me. If you want to watch these over in full with me, um, unedited or just get them sooner than uh, YouTube, go ahead and check out my Patreon below. We also have exclusive shows only on Patreon. You will not get them on YouTube, so go check those out. Thanks for joining me, and I will see you later, friends, for the next video. Have a great rest of your day.